today I'm gonna be playing the worst, the most god awful flash games in existence. Why am I doing this? Why am I torturing myself? I just one simple, one simple fact. When I was young, you call him an asshole like a normal kid. Dad, I was just trying to. Stanley, you call your friend an asshole this instant. Asshole. I played a shit ton of flash games. I'm sure you did as well. We all did. But I'm pretty sure you know some of them just plain old sucked ass. And today, we're gonna be playing the top 10 worst flash games of all time. And if I miss your worst flash game, leave it down in the description. Subscribe. Leave it down in the comments. We'll get to that next. Yeah, let's, let's check it out. And if you never played a bad flash game, if you only played the good ones, click off this video now. Save yourself. Don't do this. Click off it right now. I got a list of the top 10 worst flash games ever. And the way I got this list, if you wanna play too, is super simple. Just type in worst. Literally, is all I did. Worst flat worst flash games. There's a there's a list online. There's literally a list online for top ten worst flash games of all time. And we're gonna try them out. And we're gonna start with I've already pulled it up. We're gonna start with Dancing Coyotes. And let's let's, let's, let's for off rip. What is this? What 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 is this screen? What is it? This it already looks trash. What is this? All right. Is it not audio? Oh, my headset's not on. You guys are probably hearing trash. I'm not. Listen to this theme song. Hit. It's not that bad, actually. Now that I'm listening to it. It's like. It's like the worst Beethoven I ever heard. Oh my gosh, it loops and it doesn't even sync. Hence, you move your key. You move with arrow keys and you aim. Fire with your mouse. You aim and fire with your mouse. Okay. What the, <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is this? Did you see a girl? The violent trigger is Chico Lorenzo. Sorry, I no, I haven't. I ain't seen her, bro. I, I definitely ain't seen her shoot at her. And the father Chico Lorenzo arrived to Coyote City. Bro, what the what are we playing right now? Oh my gosh. There's no way to like make this full screen up. <gasps> Guys, there's full screen! Man encounter. Sorry for the body father Chico Lorenzo. But some people are out some people outside are looking for you. Okay. I just got you just got limited bullets, really? What's the pause menu like? Uh just pause. Okay. Father Chico Lorenzo. What is it? Who seeks me? Cowboy one, Nino, the Del Piro. He wants he wants you out of his way. You're ready to die. Hint, you can fire while moving, you can evade while firing. Oh my god, this combat, bro, this combat. This game is so loud. Oh my fucking gosh. Give it. This combat is top tier. This combat is, is, is top tier. Oh my gosh. Hold on, what if I just stand over here? I want, oh, oh shit, nope, can't do that. That was stage one? That was, it's better than I thought, honestly. It's better than I thought it was gonna be, honestly. But like, it's still pretty freaking bad. It's better than I thought it was going to be. I'm not going to lie. The farmer said that they knew what had happened. They have problem with Nino. I think that it had to be translated, right? They have problems with Nino Dio Piero's band. And they know our protagonist does too. They asked him for help. They were trying to recover a gold mine that they that belonged to their family back from Nino Del Piero's band. Obtained... Two dual bullet, dual bullet, dual bullets. It hits twice as strong, consumes twice the ammunition. We got ammunition. It may be selected from the top buttons during gameplay. Really? Save and continue. Okay, so how do I switch? I guess I just click on it. We got, we got ammo now. Okay. How, how comes? A priest is interested in gold mine, cause gold. I'll tell you. 
gym to the west there is is Oh my gosh, this game sucks. <laughs> I don't like the music at all. Jim to the West, there is a gold mine. It belonged to us until Nino Del Perro stole it. Everyone who helps us take it back will get part of the money. Agree? Agree. I'll help you. No tricks. Okay. Don't worry. But hey, I ain't gonna lie. The story is the story. Yeah. What's, the sad? What's that sound? They heard me shoot the gun? It's the little Parizzo guy. Bro, I thought I had, I thought I had ammo. What the hell? I don't know. Oh my gosh. I'm out of here. See you later. Bro, what happened to my gun? Oh my gosh. I moved so fast. I just now noticed that. Bro, this is... What are they talking about? This is game of the year. It's, it's so loud. This, this is so loud. I can't... I probably sound so loud talking, but this... This is so loud in my, oh my gosh. <sighs> we're, gonna, we're, gonna, we're gonna see it through. And we did indeed see it through. I literally sat here playing this dog shit ass freaking game. I think, I think I can get lost in this game. If I would play it for real, I think I could actually like, I could have a little bit of fun. It's not terrible. It's like, it's easy. Yeah. But take your seat. Piece by piece. Riding their horses, the group left Coyote City. Suddenly, hostile Indians appear. Cowboy won. There are Indians ahead. Tip. Move with the arrow keys and aim to fire with the mouse. Avoid cactus when level when distance is zero. Bro, this is so historically accurate, bro. Oh shit, I got a new revolver. What did this do? Kills me? Sweet. Oh my god, this is this is so oh this is so difficult. What? I don't barely I barely made it. Save me then you. Yeah. You are a wild priest. Shoot people up. Chico Lorenzo. Actually, I am not a priest. I just dressed this way to escape the sheriff of Oak Wahus. Jim, escape the sheriff. What are you? Chico Lorenzo, I bluffed at poker and lost him. I had to run away fast. Jim, all right. Don't try to stop. Don't try to play smart on us, son. Or you die, Chico Lorenzo. Don't worry. Working clean this time. Cowboy one. All right. The guys of Neil Deal are attacking our group, our camp. Well, we gonna have to blast these monstrosos up. Dang, he took a lot of bullets. That mission was difficult. That mission was really difficult. Jim. We spotted a, a caravan for Nino Del Pelro. We will assault it. You go by the right and keep them busy. We will get them by the pride from the other side. I I do reckon I, I'd keep them busy. Don't take too long and I get down with that surprise. Damn, how many bullets he gonna take? Bro, look at these, bro. Look at these graphics, bro. For a flash game? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I'm gonna take cover behind this here wagon, and I ain't gotta worry about no yacht dang shoot booters. Bro. I'm almost out of ammo. What happens when you run out of ammo? I guess we'll never know. <gasps> I had a new gun. I didn't even use it. What to use it next round? She called her in the who's higher, Jim. She and my sister Camille. Camille, I I had to come. Coyote City is no longer safe. Also, it's a family issue right here. Jim, Camille, don't grow, don't grow obsessed with the must. Must, mustache woman. <laughs> Chico Lorenzo. Mustache woman. Jim. Mustache woman is a member of the enemy group. Her mustache inspired her to become a gunner. Chico Lorenzo. I see. They should have had me for the voice acting. This game be ten times better. Jim. Tomorrow, we all will attack. We'll attack Coyote Canyon. Sleep well tonight.
and thus the band rode on their horses toward Coyote Canyon. But it was but it was clear that they would have to fight the rival horses. Yeah, what well, the way to Coyote Canyon would probably be full of danger. Undoubtedly so. Cowboy one, here they come. Damn, I try that new gun out. Oh, this is <laughs> what is this level? Yeah, yeah, I'm just gonna sit in the edge of the screen, you know. This is this is some tough gameplay right here. Oh man, this is some real tough gameplay right here. I don't know, I don't know how I can win this. Oh shoot, oh shoot. Dying on these stupid levels, over and over and over again. And how? I was, how? For some, reason, for some reason, something possessed me. I'm so to play sorry, the game I and get as far as I possibly could. So please, so please, enjoy this video. Like, subscribe, whatever. Just like, I don't know why. I, I, I don't know why I had set through this dog shit ass game, but I did. Um, here's some random clips of me just getting through. Let's go! <laughs> I can't believe I'm excited to be on mission. Oh my god, that mission was so ass. Stage clear, baby. I don't know. He want to hear the voiceovers? Here they go. Yeah. All right. We will try to take those. How? We will try to take the house at the bottom. Coyote Bravo is there. He must be tough. Rumors say he eats hot chili with hot sauce. Here you go. I was a pretty sweet, good voice actor. Yeah, yeah. But I literally said through this entire freaking game. I'm going to uh, cut through it, though. Sweet. I don't want this video to be two hours long. So I'm going to cut through most of the footage. And um, we just show you some cool parts. Look at that cool part. Uh, boss fight. Boss fight. Boss fight. Boss fight. Thank you. You are so brave, huh? Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. <laughs> Man, that was a tough boss fight. Look at that cool part. Great and big. Look at that cutie. Oh, cute cat, cute cat. Mm. Anyway, go, back to it. Look, look at that cool part. Yeah. I, I don't know what I was thinking, but yeah, 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 with 3D-ish graphics, and even a plot. The problem with this game is, well, everything. 3D graphics are just a bunch of poorly created textures, and the story is boring. It involves a hero whose name I forgot, some villain who eats chili with hot sauce, and some other idiot who had a crush on the main hero, I suppose. I think it takes place in Mexico, or in Italy. I really don't know. Remember, the Spaghetti Westerns? I have seen two versions of it. One where wah, 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 the hero takes the girl at the end, and another where he dumps her. What the fuck? This game was so terrible that sometimes it, it, it's actually good. But still, it makes it to, the, to this list. And do, and do they honestly try to sell us Russian bribes? So, I didn't mention yet, but we also have a tier list. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna mark these games on tier of their shittiness. Uh, <laughs> so let's go over to the tier list. There's three tiers: F tier for shitty, F for as in like an F in school, and then C as in like a C in school. It's it's, it's all right. It's cool. I'm thinking I'm thinking Coyote. Eh, it's gonna go with F for uh yeah. Yeah, it's gonna be. We're gonna start this off with F tier. That wasn't. That wasn't a worst playthrough ever, but that was certainly not the best. Like we're gonna put it. In, we're gonna put Coyote in um, F tier. It was not the. It wasn't. It wasn't terrible. It wasn't shitty, but it was certainly an F. Like that was. That was a failure. Hundred <laughs> percent. I would not be playing that again. I couldn't even. I don't even know what the hell the ending was. If that was the ending, like it crashed. I don't know. Um, yeah, we're gonna just leave that there. Elf, the storyline was whack. The, the the music was whack. The the gameplay was only reason it's an elf. It was sometimes it was actually it was so bad that sometimes it was actually kind of fun to play. I'm not lying. Like it was so bad. Sometimes it was actually kind of fun. So for a kid's flash game, I, when I was little, if I was playing it, I, I would have probably beat it. I probably would beat it. So it'll, it'll get an elf. All right, moving on. It's hair whack. Gear, whack, his jewelry, whack, his foot stance, whack, the way that he talks, whack, the way that he doesn't even like to smile, whack, me, I'm tight as fuck. Alright, next up on the list is Bleach Flash Game from 
2007. This game is based on the popular Japanese anime, Bleach. I haven't watched it yet, I heard it's pretty good. Unfortunately, there are some differences between the, the anime and the game. The anime has interesting characters, cool moves, and a great plot, whereas the game makes all of these. What's left? A boring, half-baked combat game. Right. Alright, so, Bleach Flash game, let's, let's, let's look it up. We got... A huge cup of coffee. Pretty strong. We're gonna coffee up, and then we're gonna start in the next one. Let's start this next one. All right, so let's check out this Bleach one. It's gotta be good. Disclaimer: I never played Bleach. Uh, this is my first interaction with Bleach. Hairstyle. You get to pick hairstyles. We're gonna go with the first one. Raku Rakunga, my home. I don't remember how I got here. It's where people go when they die. After people's death, some get their souls eaten by hollows. Some, the lucky ones, are brought to the, this world by bleaches. <laughs> I entered this world when I was very little. Grew up with a very, with a very other kid, few other kids, and called someone father, who taught me many things. Whatever I mentioned the, the bleaches, but whenever I mentioned the bleaches, he would never tell me how they are like. <laughs> One day, I saw a young man, sitting in a splendid horse carriage, got about several men in black. Everyone looked at him with envy. That was the first time I saw ble a bleach. People say the bleaches are the most respected and feared people in Wakanga. They protect this world. From then on, I have kept on training my soul power. I feel I am not too far away from my goal of becoming a bleach. I will start my journey tomorrow. No matter what my father says anymore. I mean, oh my gosh. What is this? What is this, an RPG? No, I'm gonna put the quality on high. Just make sure. It's, it's... Father, you want to be a bleach, the deaf god. How many times have I told you? Not just anybody can be the deaf god. You may end up dead if you were not careful. Aim instruction. Oh my gosh. This is not as loud as for y'all, is it for me, is it? Up, down, left, right. J is a cuckoo, K, and then. Okay, okay. I saw the play. It's kind of standard. In the beginning, you only have a limited number of techniques to use. In order to master more techniques, you need to improve your play level. Sweet. Sweet. Action. Ooh, oh, oh, oh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Am I out of, like, energy? I can only press J. Bro. I'm out of M magic power. What is this, bro? How much damage does a slime do? What? Mom, I'm getting out of here. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, they can go to past frames? I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I just got beat by slimes. And it's stuck going in one direction. Uh, what the hell's going on? Bro, what the crap? Oh, I can run? Help me, help me, help me, help me. I can help you erase all the signs and tribute to you. What? You got a Texan for 1500 Bro, that does nothing. Yeah, I have the strat. Break the knees. Bro, what is going on? They keep spawning. What is going on?
Yeah, mo moving on. Told B Call Me, Jumpman, 2007. Oh, not another 2007. 2007. Oh my, the tragedy. The tragedy. This game tried to be an exact clone of Super Mario Bros. Except they tried to be original at the same time. The lousy gameplay is only rivaled by the lack of spirit in the levels. It's a game where your characters set out to find treasures and become rich while ha having a cool adventure. But at the end, they end up killing Dracula and take home a hot princess. I guess this is what happens when developers smoke leaf. Okay, let's check it out. Alright. Novus Media Mediatek. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay. Yellow. So, you think you will travel about you you and uh, I can't I will travel the whole world. All yeah, right. Next thing you just say if you find a princess, sure, why not? Let's go get, let's get going then. Shit, it is our bros plans though. It's two This game is two players. We ran into our first two-player flash game. I just gotta bump it up a point right there. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, the controls are so fast. Pick them up on walk. Pick them. Ah, oh, shoot. This is like something I would make. <laughs> when I've tried to develop, this is like when I tried to develop video games. This is like the asset pack they give you to try to make your first free video game. What? What was that? Okay. Oh my gosh. They the game sounds so loud for me. I'm, you guys are being saved right now. What the hell? I get smaller when I get hit? Oh my gosh, it's so janky. What is it, a pot of gold? See? What, what am I collecting all these coins for? It was the journey along the way that counts. It's okay, we got. It's okay, we got two lives left. I like when you jump on someone's head, you bounce again. That's kind of cool. Oh, okay. So it gives me like power. Okay. What the hell is that? It's like an enemy, I guess. All right. <laughs> Level complete. Yay! I'm not. I'm not really happy about that. What the hell is that? Like a nuke? What the freak is going on? Uh, power up. Oh my gosh. All right, last life. No! Uh, have a bug. We have. We have. Can I get. And hey, moving on! Tabakoki Jumpman goes to. F tier. Uh, it was, it was play, it was playable, but it was pretty, pretty, pretty dank. It was no, no. It's closest. It's close to S tier, but but I mean, it was playable. Freaking Bleach was not playable, so we're gonna uh, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna go with F tier. That was F tier. Next up on the list, we'll be playing one of my favorite characters ever. A Batman. We got um Batman Flash game 2008, so we're finally out of 2007. This game is based in the AC comics. AC, like air conditioning comics. What? 
What do you mean, DC? In the DC comics character, Batman, that actually has an interesting presentation. Unfortunately, controls don't feel smooth and your punches don't hit the enemies unless you are over them. The game is boring. It's full of video game cliches such as falling bombs all the way through, and Batman has to save Catwoman. What the fuck? Must, must have been another development developer who had a boner over Michelle <laughs> in Batman Returns. I don't think this is it. I was just like really curious what the hell this was. This is something else. This actually looks good. Skip all that. We're not gonna play this. I just, I'm just curious. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. While looking for the tra most tragic Batman game, we have found the greatest Batman game in all existence. I mean, look at this. Look at this. Oh my gosh, where's the enemies? We can glide. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. We just found the best Batman game ever. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. What? 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 Oh my gosh. What is this game? How do I punch again? I was punching earlier. I swear I was punching. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, bro, look at look at how he punches. What what is what is this? I would pay for this. I would pay five bucks for this. At least. I mean look at this. Look at this. Oh my gosh. That's the boss. Boss fight, boss fight. And we lost. Yeah, uh, yeah, we're just gonna we're just gonna like put that in the golden tier. Uh I'm not even gonna look for the other game. That game was so impressive. Got it. Got it. Alright, next up. Go go emo rangers 2009 during a short period of time during, during the year 2006 a group of teenagers decided to make power rangers like make a power rangers parody on youtube known as the emo rangers these videos were funny funny and even shown on mtv uk in 2009 a small video game studio decided to make a flash game based on the emo rangers and this game was born it didn't take long before the public realized that yet another disgrace had happened in the world of video games as this game was boring unfunny repetitive cool, and fell off old and, and, and full of old and tired stereotypes the, the batman game i just mentioned is top quality when compared to this nice job fan <laughs> the language whoa I just seen, I just seen the um, um, abysmal quality of this game. I got the, I got so depressed. I think I became emo. Yeah, whatever. Oh no, no, there we go. Hey, it's my, it's my pizza. <laughs> emo ranger. <laughs> what the fuck is the emo ranger? <laughs> Bro, that was lit. In Halloween, five emo teens are hanging together, chilling, playing video games, listening rock, and playing emo poetry. Love is slowly running out. The end is now drawing near. Our last kiss is approaching. Damn it, I didn't read fast enough. <laughs> Evil Emperor, hi, pitiful planet. I totally destroyed it and made it mine. Emperor Evil, I will send my evil heavy patrol and evil rock. Damn it, too fast to read. Oh my gosh. Bro, this is creepy. I got to stop smoking. Let's see if I hit. I kept the emote to do. But that. Oh my gosh. Okay, this is kind of trash. We're going to skip this. You control introspective emo ranger in the city. I am finding myself totally alone in the fight against the hoodie patrol. What could the me what could this what could the meaning of this be? Maybe the others don't like me. Where are they? Skills fires depression raising enemies. 
causing emotion and emotional emotional damage and physical damage punch is what oh my gosh I shot him with depression Oh yeah, depression. Oh my gosh, what the fuck? You're, you found you found chaos, Bohawk. Emo Ranger in the warehouse. Hot key too. Grr, I hate the hoodie patrol. I hate them more than high school. Gee, damn. He's more he's more than the government. Trying to kick some major butt. Like right now. Skill. Somewhat stronger physical attack than the other emo ranger. His energy shockwave only hits nearby targets, but packs a punch. Okay. So. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Hey, jumping me. They're jumping him. Emo punch! Oh my gosh. Okay, so, uh, you guys asked for it. I might have to hit you with the, the, the pressure, the pressure, uh, uh, depression. Uh, I'm out of depression. Shit, I'm out of depression. All right, all right. I guess this power is these things or something. Bro, they, bro, they, they're kicking my ass. They're kicking my ass. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. No, I got to see it through. All right, bro. What does he mean? What do they mean? This game is trash, bro. This game is awesome. This, what does he mean? That is the least trash game of the list. That is the least, that, what, it, what does he mean is trash? I, I, I don't, I don't understand. That game, that game is freaking awesome. Yeah, Emo Rangers is in the goaded tier. Uh, officially, Emo Rangers is, is, is goaded. Emo Rangers is goaded. It's it's even more goaded than, than than the Batman game. Emo Rangers is goaded, like top tier. Goaded. Okay, let's see what's next on this. Now that that was goaded. Like you you you're, you're literally shooting people with depression. How could it not be fun? <laughs> how could how could you shoot people with depression? How is that? How could it not be fun? <laughs> I have crippling depression. All right, so next up on the list is Ninja vs. Pirates War, 2009. Around 2008, maybe earlier, some strange bad started on the internet. It's consistent in determining who are better, ninjas or pirates. Well, for sure, either of them are better than this game. This game is supposed to allow players to pick a side and allow them to determine if they are high scores, determine their high scores and such. It's suffering a series of problems such as that both sides are not balanced and that graphics leave a lot to be desired, especially the animated things. And last but not least, there are some major problems with the whole game. It sucks. Sorry, but there was no nice way to say it. Next. Ninjas vs. Pirates. Hey, anything sound pretty nice. Hmm. Oh. We about to power some games and ninja it out. Power some games and ninja it out. I walk it through like what it's about. I don't know, but he playing that flute. We got to go and get to it because you know we're going to do it. Like shoot, boom, boom, and we flutin' it, do it. I know my boss aren't that clean, but guess what? I pirated them, so who don't care? I'm gonna get out of here like a ninja. I'm gonna disappear. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry. Let me just play the game. Oh my gosh, I can't rap on this goddamn flute. So open it's so fun. Look at this stuff. Mm. Ooh, 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 hey. <laughs> sorry. That was bad. Oh my gosh, how many levels are there? Parrots fight. What? What? You slithering sprays. Is it just a rip off of Angry Birds? Oh my gosh. Then the, 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 is this the ninjas? 
what the hell is going on? This is the game. Really? It's just a rip off of Angry Birds. Bro, what? Except you get this you get to shoot on them many times. Yeah. Yeah. You already know what I'm about to say. Next! Yeah. Pirates versus ninjas. It's uh, S tier for sh shitty. Shitty. I'm getting That's about as shitty as it gets. Uh, just a rip off. A, a sad rip off of Angry Birds. And, uh, yeah. Yeah. Shitty. Alright. Next up on the list is. Robot Rangers, the Zombie Menace. 2009, you must be thinking, wow, a game with both robots and zombies? This must be totally awesome. Well, think again. This game proves this way of thought totally wrong. There's another Power Ranger pair to go wrong. You control one robot, which is the hero. It's, it fires lasers from his eyes. Other robot rangers come to help you, but they are not even characters. They are just shots. But instead of drawing a bullet or a laser, they drew a robot. <laughs> wow, lame. Some people actually think this game is fun. Do you know what else is fun? Killing rabbits with a screwdriver. Hey, but wait, there is more. It's hard to know when you get hurt, and controls are as counterintuitive as they can be. Way to ruin a totally great concept. My bad. Alright, I'll be the judge of that. Let's, uh, let's check it out. Okay, here we are. I thought I was like, gonna be like a Power Ranger. Okay. Okay. Why didn't they just move? Why do I have to press V to move? Why didn't they just move me? One. Okay. At least the music, the background music is fire. Okay. I could just spam? I could just spam the OP? I could just spam them, they're OP. What? What does three do? Are you serious? I could just spam them? What? I could just spam them. Oh my god. What's for the lightning? Robot robots power dangers. They're so lame. Robot power rangers. They're super lame. Robot power rangers. They're super lame. Robot Power Rangers, they're super lame. Oh my god. Why is this music so good, though? That was it. The Robot Rangers defeated all the zombies who were defeat threatening. Robot Lane and them out as a victory. That's it. That, that, that's it? Really? Really? F tier. I feel like if I, if I was little, I could play it a few times. So, moving on. Not to mention the music was smacking. Number three, Superman Flash Game, 2007. A Flash game in the popular superhero, Superman. The Flash game really depicts in rather, in rather poorly. After two minutes of playing, I didn't figure out what to do. And, off, and the awful graphics, 16 colors at most maybe, didn't help much either. The game is not very attractive at all. And it's a shame because it could have been Superman. It could have been. And it's a shame because it could have been. Superman had been incredibly lucky in the video games world. Has he? Cough. Anyone remember Superman 64? <coughs> I do, and it was it wasn't that bad. It, it was what? Oh my god! <laughs> oh my gosh! This this y'all goat though. This, this y'all goat though. Oh my gosh! I played I played this. I actually played this before. I think I played this while I was in school. I had like three minutes to play it. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I did it. Wow. Wow.
Was that kryptonite? Bet some old lady dropped it out of her purse. Oops. Oh my gosh. Wow. <laughs> oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Yeah. Uh S tier. Yeah, S tier. That, that was that was pretty shitty. You know, we're gonna we're gonna have it between S and F tier. So yeah, we're gonna have it like right here between S and F tier. So we're gonna have it connected to S tier because it was shitty, but we're gonna have it at F tier because it's it's almost playable. It is it's almost playable. So it's it's like it's like it's like it's kind of hard to call. We're gonna we're just gonna we're gonna stick it right here. Uh, we, we're gonna we're just gonna you know what? Hang on. We're just gonna stick it in the uh, we're we're just gonna pink, pink pink kryptonite tier uh pink 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 kryptonite tier yeah uh <laughs> moving on <laughs> moving on that shall go though that shall go though that shall go though that sh that shall go though that shall go though all right so um. Next up on the list is Galactic 123 The Mission 2011. Whoa! This was a good candidate for number one worst flash game, but didn't make it there. Not sure, maybe let's make it a tie between this and number one. Anyways, where do I begin? This is supposed to be some 3D space saga game with a plot, but 3D graphics that look like paper cutouts, horrendous animations, and waves after waves of space mutant frogs that appear in 99% of fights were enough to kill off this project. At least for the time being, they have promised to remake anime style. On the, on the bright side, I am 100% sure that the remake will be better. No way in the world that, that it can be worse than, than this piece of shua! Looks a little bit better. Uh, we have mini games. Let's start with the main thing. Earth is the head of a mighty nation known as the Turian Union. It rules with an iron fist, but but a faraway planet has rebelled. Lieutenant Ivino, this reminds me of Star Wars. Poor Leon, you will undergo a shot to tire. Ooh, aim and fire with the mouse. Select the weapon. Get the buttons at the top. This is already look like dancing coyotes, but with outer space. Really? <laughs> this is a down. We come full circle. What is this? Oh shoot! It's a real Glock in Star Wars. They got a real Glock. The Force can't do nothing. Hold on, hold on. He said this game is trash. This is like the better version of Dancing Coyote. Alright, I don't want this video to be any longer than it already is, so uh, I'm coming in with the voiceover to save you guys. So pretty much, it's a better version of Coyote, but with Star Wars, Coyote City, uh, it got some choices to make, like right here. Hey, board and escape pod, so they can turn off the weapons of the main ship they need. Yeah, finding some asteroids. Oh my gosh. This is, oh my yeah, one line in the description, there are gay frogs. Okay. Oh my gosh, I'm shooting frog, frogs with the blicky. He's turning the frogs gay! <laughs> it's gay! I'm getting attacked by gay frogs! Oh my god! God damn, what are we in? Florida? Average day in Florida. Gotta defend yourself from gay frogs, bass, and alligators. Uh, uh guy trying to turn yeah. his life around, and uh, it's not the worst game for the list. Oh but, uh, my god, it was, I ain't gonna lie, it was so boring that I forgot to play the last game. So let's just show some real quick scenes and yeah, jump right to the last game. Okay, okay, yeah, uh, that's good. We're gonna go ahead and mark, mark this. Okay, um, the fake Star Wars game, it, it, it gotta see, it was, it was it's cool. I feel like if you were a little on your planet, you probably have a, like a decent time. Uh, wasn't worse. It was certainly better than Dancing Coyotes. Hundred percent better than Mario, and definitely better than that. It's, I feel like this game has the most potential for long-term play. Uh, yeah, that's all the games on the list. 
Alright, so uh, real quick, I am not about to turn the camera on. It is 3.23 a.m. I've been editing this video all day. We're gonna finish. <laughs> this is the last game. Uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> I say he only edited this because damn it's not a shit. He only edited this because the guy thinks this is a good game. This is a phenomenal game. Bye guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If I missed any of your flash games that you think were even trash in this, leave them in the comments and I might make a part two to this. Uh yeah. Don't forget to like and don't forget to like and subscribe and uh yeah. Depression race! Depression race! Ah! Alright, peace out.